What's, What's up, up you guys? guys? Welcome back to our channel and today we are trying Turkish snacks. So we actually got this box off of Amazon. I think it was $14 for 12 different snacks. We've never been to Turkey, so we have no idea what kind of snacks they have. Yeah. So we're excited to try this because this is something new for us. Yeah. But this is what it looks like when you open it up. And this pamphlet shows basically all the snacks that we get, the different kinds that we get. And we'll probably read them off to you as we try them. Oh, you know, they have all the stars so we can rate them. I just realized that. Is that what that's for? I mean, that's what I would use it for. Because um, all these stars are... Um, oh, here. It says right here. Rate your snacks and share your thoughts on social media. Yeah, see? Mm -hmm. You're right, you're right. So we're going to take all these snacks out of the box and then we'll be right back. A few minutes later. Alright. Here's all the snacks. Mm -hmm. You know what's funny is <laughs> they give you instructions. It's like you're playing board games and underneath every snack, it's uh, there's uh, suggestions for what kind of drinks yeah. you you want you can drink it with. Mm -hmm. um, so except we only have water, so that's yeah. what we're going with. <laughs> that's fine. The first one is called cat cat cat. No, it's not. Oh, cat cat tat. <laughs> yeah. Cat cat tat. All right. Well, okay. you can show it to the camera. That's what it is. Cat cat tat. What is the description? It's a croissant. It, croissant. It's a. Cr <laughs> <laughs> it's a croissant-ish bakery in a Turkish style filled with goodness inside. This one comes with different shape and size. It has different flavor other than chocolate. These are strawberry and sesame seed flavors. Oh. You can cause deliciousness in oh every level as we call it in Turkish. Cat cat tat. This one says it's hazelnut cream filled. Yep. So that's what it looks like. That, it looks like a puff, puff pastry. pastry. It does. It okay. does look I like I I'll go first. Yeah. Ooh, crunchy. What's your first impression? It's good. It's not too sweet. Very flaky. Mm-hmm. Very flaky. So you're eating Nutella inside a crunchy croissant. Inside a puff pastry. I like it. Yeah, and it's not too sweet. That one's good. And they're right. It would be great with some coffee. Or tea. Alright, your turn. How, how, how many stars are you rating that one? Three. I would say two and a half. The second one is poti cake. I mean, I don't know if it's actually poti cakes. Where is yeah, it? Yeah, try to find it. Right here. Description. Either carrot, coconut, fruit, or chocolate flavored. These cakes are a great idea if you love puffy stuff. Mm. Poti has no meaning in Turkish, but some Turkish people call it as Best packaged cake ever. Hope you agree with them. <laughs> Is this what it looked like? Sorry if we are pronouncing these wrong. Obviously, we don't know how to speak Turkish. Turkish so, yeah. But it is um, carrot and cinnamon cake. Ooh. So, we'll see. First oh. impression, it looked like a banana cake. Like a banana bread? Banana bread. A tiny one, a mini one. Very spongy and airy. Here you go. Here I go. Cheers. Like a sponge cake. Mmm. Mmm. It's like a carrot like cake. Mm-hmm. It's like a carrot cake. It's be really good in the morning for mm -hmm. breakfast with some coffee. Or tea. Mmm. Mm. The cake is moist. And very dense. Dense and moist. That gets a three out of three stars yeah. for me. Clean, clean my palate. Clean your palate. The next one is called Kubuk. <laughs> okay, maybe don't try to pronounce it because I actually tried to look up how to pronounce it. Uh -huh. And it's, it's, yeah, it's hard. Something cracker. Oh, so this is the one. They look like pretzel sticks. Mm hmm. Yeah. All right. The legacy item. This thing, is, aka stick crackers, is the most basic snack ever produced in the snack world. Oh yeah, it's like a po pokey. Mmm. Mmm. What? That's a good pretzel cracker. Yeah, it's a pretzel cracker. There's like no salt on it though. This one is very basic to me. 
two star because it's basic. Yeah. Yeah. It's just like normal pretzel stick. Nothing special. About Nothing that special, one. but yeah. The next one is crispy spicy. Ooh, crispy spicy. Crispy Yum. spicy. Man, I feel like reading these are like tongue twister. But it also says the same thing. So it's pretzels probably. Yep. Probably sticks. Or sticks. Said so you either get you get either or both of these options. They have hot cheesy and or just a spicy one. This one just says spicy stick. Spicy sticks. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. It tastes like Italian seasoning. Yes, it has 10 herbs on it. It literally tastes like Italian seasoning. Mmm, that sounds good. It's good. Not spicy at all. No. Very flavorful. Mm hmm. Three out of three. Three out of three. All right, next one. Alpella. Why does it say three gen? Yeah, it's three gen. It's right oh. here. Wait. Wait, this one's Alpella too. Yeah, but three gen is this one. Oh, OBG? this one. This one's three gen. It says Pyramid of Chocolates, a temple where all chocolate lovers worship. Inspired by pyramids in Egypt, this chocolate bar is a white chocolate covered wafer with a unique taste. Ooh. What is this unique taste? Hmm. We're about to find out. Yeah. This looks like uh, Toblerone. <laughs> it does. Mmm. So that's what it looks like now. Mmm. Can you see it? Oh, okay. I need to try it now. Mmm. So good. Mmm. This has like something that's like a feeling, some sort of feeling in there. The first bite is like a very classic white chocolate taste. And then oh. you get the wafer. That's very like wafery. That is so good. Yeah, this is this is the bomb. This I would give this four stars. What is the unique? I have no thing idea. Though. It's like, the it's the feeling or something. I don't know. Yeah, that's really good. I'm gonna take another bite. That is definitely like a five out of three stars. Yeah, it was bomb. That one's really good. We'll save this for later. We still have a lot of snacks to go through, so. Yep. The next one is Wanted. 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 A chocolate bar filled with caramel sauce and covered with puffed rice. Puffed rice? It is the favorite of most consumers in Turkey. Sounds like a chocolate bar we would have here. Yep. Oh, so these, I get these are puffed rice. It's like all these low. Maybe it's like, um, What's that cereal? Yeah, like Rice Krispies. Okay. You take but these are that. giant puffer rice things. Very crunchy. Mm -hmm. mm. I like that. Oh my gosh. Who's the one that's over here making a mess? Yeah. So bad. Mmm, <laughs> good. Tastes like, like Rice Krispie treat. Kova and chocolate and have um, caramel, milk. caramel in the middle. Like two stuff for me. <laughs> I give this a mm, two and a half out of three. The next one is chin or sin. Oh no, that one is actually pronounced, I looked it up, it's gin. Gin? Because it says it means genie. Oh, gin mean genie in gin. English. Gin, or maybe it's gin. Gin? Gin. So the C Gini. is like a G. Yeah, I think. Oh, I think it's an orange, chocolate orange biscuit. Chocolate orange biscuit? Mm-hmm. Mmm. Mmm. This is what mm. it look like. I, I like that texture. That's like a sprinkler, chocolate sprinkle. Sprinkle? Sprinkler. Chocolate <laughs> sprinkle. <laughs> I'm, all, I'm all over the place today. Let's look like that. Wow, I'm not usually a big fan of like chocolate, orange with chocolate, but like there's a layer of cho I mean of like orange jam, mm -hmm, there is. like on the biscuit, and mm -hmm. then there's like the chocolate sprinkles. Mm -hmm. The texture is really good. It's like uh, cookies. Like a soft cookie. Soft cookies. It's like crunchy but still soft in the middle, you know. It's very hard for you guys to see. Yeah. But it's like right here in between the biscuit and uh, the cookies and the uh, chocolate spring sprinkle. <laughs> anyway, what I'm saying is, it's a three out of three for me. Yeah, it's a two and a half out of three for me. Next one is pizza. Yep. Pizza, pizza, pizza. So it just looks like a cracker. Pizza crackers. Pizza cool. crackers. 
So what I'm getting is pretty much around the world, we have some similarities in snacks. Yeah. We like pizza flavor things. I wonder if it's because like Turkey is in like in between Asia and Europe, so there's a lot of like you know mm. international tourism or like influence. Maybe. It's like the goldfish texture. Texture, but it tastes like you're eating pizza. But very subtle. I taste the Italian herbs. Italian. He just went Italian. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> tomato sauce. But it's not salty. No. Yeah. It's, it's pretty good. Good snack too. Yeah, like calor and the calories for all these snacks are like pretty decent. Right. Okay. Four more snacks left. This and one. And it's all sweet ones. Keefins. Keefins? Yeah, I think that's what I call. Thin layer of enhanced crispiness with crushed wafer particulars inside the chocolate. Yeah, it is like a chocolate bar. They said this one is uh, one of the newer snacks in Turkey. It is newer, huh? My take so far is a lot of these snacks are chocolate base cover. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's because a lot of people like to eat it with like I their mean, Turkish coffee. Yeah, or, Turkish coffee. Or, or chocolate like, is just a common snack around the yeah, world. That's true. You know? Cheers. Mmm, interesting. The flavor doesn't come till a lot after. It just tastes like a crunchy chocolate. Mm-hmm. It's good though, it's good chocolate. Very yeah. milky, milky, creamy. Milky, milky. Mm-hmm. All right, next one is Nutty Max Wafer. Nutty? Yeah, Nutty. You don't think it's nutty? All right. Nutty Max. Nutty Max Wafer. I mean, we don't know. We don't know how it's pronounced. If you see this, it's the English label on it. Ooh, this definitely is a wafer. Look at all the three layers and the wafer. All right, here you go. Crunchy. Mmm. I like this. Mmm. Mm-hmm. It's very airy. Airy to watching. It's a little bit nutty, a little bit sweet, a little bit chocolatey, mm -hmm. a little bit creamy. Also, we're gonna save all these snacks for later. We're not throwing it away, just FYI. Yeah. But we can't eat all of this in like one sitting, you know, especially we're trying so many snacks. Mm hmm. All right, the next one's called Hobby. One of the oldest standing snacks in the market. Hobby is a light chocolate for casual snacking. Ooh, okay. So Looks like, Look like a nut. Look like another cookies. <laughs> like a biscuit. B dip in chocolate. Yeah. Ooh. Mm. There's caramel in it. What? You're pointing at something. It's like the same texture as this one. I like it. That's good. The caramel is getting stuck in my teeth. Me too. But it's really good. You know what I like about this snack so far is the sweetness is not overwhelming. Yeah, mm-hmm. I I agree. It's bearable for me. Like they're so sweet. They're like you know if you guys know, there's some snacks that are like sweet and then some are like diabetes. <laughs> like, anyway, this is good. I can enjoy it. We stopped rating at a certain point. I don't remember which one. Did we rate the pizza one? No, we did not. Two out of three for me. One and a half out of three. The Nutty Max. Two out of three. Two and a half out of three. This one's good. I like this one. Three out of three. Two and a half out of three. All right, last, last one. one. It's called Nirvana. Solid Nirvana represent the highest possible and achievable tastiness in a chocolate world. Whoa. This epic stick not only covered with white chocolate, but also with generous amount of coconut flakes. Oh, ooh, Inside, yeah, you will have a row of wafer, which is also filled with cream. All come together very well to bring happiness on another level. Holy moly. Okay. Hopefully that's focusing and you yep. can see it. Okay. You achieved Nirvana. <laughs> this is the sweetest one out of them all. Yeah. Yeah. 
super sweet. Mm -hmm. But I like it. It's if like, you like coconut, you'll really like this one. I like this one too. Three out of three. Three out of three. And honestly, there was no bad snack here. Like no. you can't go wrong. I mean, the only thing that's probably not like great would be like that. this one, just because yeah, it's, it's just so basic. You can just get an American like. It's just like pretzel sticks. Pretzel stick, yeah. Yeah. But with that, we are going to end our video today. We hope you guys enjoy watching this video. If you do, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, and hit that subscribe button. And last but not least, don't forget to keep winning, winning at, at life. life. See you next video. Bye.